स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्ड ऑफ एक्सरसाइज 1.1 क्लास एट रैशनल नंबर द क्वेश्चन सेज दैट वी हैव टू प्रूव दैट माइनस ऑफ माइनस ऑफ एक्स इज एक्स सो बाय द हेल्प ऑफ एडिटिव इनवर्स वी कैन इजीली फाइंड इट ओके सो लेट अस सी द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वेयर एक्स इज गिवन इलेवन अपॉन फिफ्टीन okay so we have to find first the additive inverse of this 11 upon 15 okay so students the additive inverse of additive inverse of x so what is the additive inverse of x the additive inverse of x will be minus of x is minus of x so if x is equal to 11 upon 15 then it will be minus 11 upon 15 so minus of x will be equal to minus of 11 upon 15 now just find the additive inverse of this equation number 1 now just find the additive inverse of this equation number 1 so how we will find the additive inverse additive inverse of minus of x will be will be minus of minus of x or uh, students minus of x is equal to minus 11 upon 15 so over there we will write what minus of minus of x will equal to minus of Minus of eleven upon fifteen. Now, students, we know the rule that minus of minus will be positive number or will be plus. So, minus of minus of x will be minus minus will be plus. It will be eleven upon fifteen. And we know that that eleven upon fifteen is equal to what? Is equal to x so minus of minus of x will be equal to x so by this we can say that this 11 upon 15 is equal to x which is also equal to minus of minus of x for the negative one we have to try with the same way okay so students we have studied that minus of minus of x will be equal to x students question number 4 says that we have to find the multiplicative inverse of the following numbers okay so what is the rule says students the rule says that when the original number is multiplied to the multiplicative inverse the result should be 1 the result should be 1 where x is the original number and x bar is the multiplicative inverse which will give you the output One. What is one? One is the multiplicative identity. So let us consider that the first number is thirteen. Let us consider the first number is thirteen. So x is equal to thirteen. So x is equal to thirteen. When x is multiplied by x bar, the result should be one. The result should be one. So let us put the value of x over here. So thirteen multiplied by x bar will give you one. Thirteen multiplied by x bar will give you what? One. So we know that if this side thirteen is in multiply, when it will change the side, it will come into divide. So x bar will be equal to one upon. 13 so we can say that 1 upon 13 is the multiplicative multiplicative inverse of 13 1 by 13 is the multiplicative inverse of 13 second question we can take any of the number suppose the number is minus 11 upon 7 so minus 11 upon 
Student, these are not the NCRT questions actually. I am taking just the examples for that. NCRT question you can solve easily with the help of these examples. So let us try minus 11 upon 7. So x into x bar will give you output 1. Put the value of x over here. Minus 11 upon 7 is equal to x bar is equal to 1. Student 7 is in divide. When we will change the side it will come into multiply. So minus 11 into x bar is equal to 1 into 7. So minus 11 into x bar will equal to 7. Now minus 11 is in multiply when we will change the sign it will come into divide so x bar is equal to 7 upon minus 11 student this this rational number is not in standard form so so to convert it into the standard form we have to multiply minus 1 upon minus 1 to the rational number so x bar can be written as 7 upon minus 11 multiplied by minus 1 upon minus 1. So the final answer will be minus 7 upon 11. So minus 7 upon 11 will be our final answer. By this method we can easily find the multiplicative inverse of the following numbers. Thank you. For the next question, we will start with the next video. Do subscribe. Thank you for watching.